Ask, we investigate a big development today after a caller wanted to know why two brothers were suspended from their high school basketball team. It happened after this picture appeared in a local newspaper. The students claim it was all in fun, but the school district believes the brothers were flashing gang signs. Lacey Crisp joins us live from Plymouth, where a big game is going to be underway tonight. Lacey. And that's right, and the brothers will play tonight. In fact, Juwan's JV game started just a couple of minutes ago. Now, the brothers were suspended after this picture ran in the local newspaper. Well, today, the school district overturned that suspension. So you're pretty happy you get to put that uniform on tonight? Yes. Jordan and brother Jawan Jackson were suspended for tonight's big matchup against rival Plymouth. The brothers and Jordan's twin Jamal post for this picture in the Sheboygan Falls News. Upset parents called the district arguing the brothers were flashing gang signs. The brothers argue they were goofing around and pointing at the camera and showing the three point sign. The family appealed the suspension today. They basically allowed us to um, give our our um, our side of our opinion why we felt that the boys should have never been suspended. The appeal worked, and the district reversed its decision. Both boys will play tonight. So you excited for going to the game tonight? Yes, uh, we're very excited. I'm a little nervous for the kids myself because uh, I can. They, they, it's been an emo, emotional roller coaster for them. Jordan tells. Me he's received emails, Facebook messages, and Twitter replies from people across the country. It's pretty surprising how big it's gotten. It started out with just me posting a single little message to the Sheboygan Falls news page on Facebook, and um, you guys show up in my house one day, and it just goes viral. Like it's awesome, though. He adds he's learned a big lesson. It's taught me to um, really think before I do something, because people. I misinterpret something, even though you're not meaning to. And Jordan tells me he is feeling a little added pressure to play well tonight, but he tells me he's hoping for a dunk. Reporting live in Plymouth, Lacey Crisp, today's TMJ4. Yeah, we're going to be up there tonight to see how that game goes, and we'll have the highlights coming up on Live at 10. Thanks a lot, Lacey. Now, if there's something you want us to check out, go to TMJ4.com tips. You ask, we investigate.